guys! So, I feel like it's been a while since I've made a video because I recently went on a trip and I was vlogging so I haven't really sat down and talked to you guys I feel like in a really long time. I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got when I was in New York City. I got a few things. Um, I didn't get a lot surprisingly because I thought I would go there and shop a lot but I actually didn't really buy anything. But what I did buy, um, I'm very proud of and I'm so happy I found these cool pieces because they're all vintage. Well, not all of them are, but most of these things are vintage. I was actually really happy to see that there were a lot of vintage clothing stores in New York. These stores actually had clothes that are kind of like what is in style nowadays, except these are vintage clothing. So I thought that was really cool that there was a lot of those kind of stores in New York. But I'm just going to get on to what I got. So the first thing I'm going to be showing you is this top from Randy Melville and I also don't have that store where I live so I was like really excited to shop there. I actually only bought one thing and then a jewelry. I was really surprised that I didn't even buy more because their things are so cute. I don't know why I didn't buy other things. I guess nothing was just catching my eye. I really like these type of t-shirts, you know, plain striped t-shirts. I'm really into these. So I'm really excited to wear this. I think that it's really cute. I feel like red really goes with like my hair color and skin color. And I really love navy blue and white. So I think these are like the perfect colors to wear. And I love stripes and... This whole t-shirt is just really cute, so I'm really happy I found this. So the last thing I got at Brandy Melville was this Toker Moon necklace. And I'm going to get a closer look so you guys can actually see. But it's just a half moon. I'm a big fan of space and stars and the moon. And I just find those things so fascinating. So I really like having jewelry that's like the moon or anything that represents something that's in the sky or in space. Okay, so the next thing is this dress. I can't remember what the store is called. I think it's like the Urban Tree Vintage Store or something like that. This store was in Brooklyn and I'm pretty sure that was the best vintage store I've ever been to. I'm so happy about this, but I haven't worn it yet and it's really hard to see on camera, but it's just this brown dress. And wow, you can't even see it. It's button up. It's like a sweater. Not really a sweater. I don't know how to explain things. I'm honestly the worst at explaining things. It's like a dress and it's long sleeve and you button it up. So, wow, this is... Okay. It's not like straight. It kind of like fits your waist and then it kind of flares out which I like about that. It says it's from Free People. I don't know if it's like the store Free People today which is really expensive. So the last three things I'm going to be showing you is from a store called Friends. The thing I liked about this store the most is that not only was it vintage clothing, it's vintage clothing that is in style. So you're not just going to a store and seeing all these clothes that aren't in style and probably are ugly but the thing about this store is that they actually had cute clothing and stuff that is actually like in style so I got this shirt and it looks kind of ugly on camera but I promise you it's really cute at least I think it's cute this is my style it has stripes which I really love and I've been trying to find a lot of striped clothing lately this costed $30 but it was so worth it because first of all it's in great shape and quality so it just has stripes on it and it has purple white blue, red, and green on it, which I love those colors, and I just think this shirt is really cute. You probably have seen this shirt before because I did post a picture with it on on my Instagram. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you should totally follow me on Instagram, but it just, it's this tie-dye shirt, and I got it for $5 because it was on the sale rack, and the tie-dye shirts that they were selling there cost at least over $30. So I've been really into like tie-dye stuff lately, so I was really happy to find this, and it was so cheap. So I got it and it's so cute. So the last thing I got at that store, friends, are these pair of star earrings. And like I said, I'm really into the whole space thing and atmosphere and stuff like that. So these earrings are really cute and really excited to wear these. This is totally my style. So I'm really happy I found these. These were $12, but you know, it's pretty reasonable, I think. I knew I would regret it if I didn't buy it, so. I bought these and I'm so excited to wear them. So that is all I got in New York and I'm so sad. So as of right now, the day I'm filming, like right now, it's been a little over a week since we've gotten back from our trip and talking about this and what I got in New York just makes me miss it even more and I'm so beyond happy that I was able to go and I am determined to live there for a month 
one day in my life because it's actually really expensive to live there but just to live there for a month would be enough for me because I just want to experience it and I want to live in all sorts of places I don't want to be in a certain spot the whole time like I want to be able to like live in other places around the world that's a goal I want to have in my life if you guys ever have a chance to go to New York I definitely recommend it it's it's a whole different vibe New York is like 10 times crazier than LA and the people there are actually really nice. I thought they would be mean. Oh, well, some people are mean. Like, sometimes they'll shove you when you're walking. That's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And also subscribe if you're new to this channel because you should subscribe. It's free and it will notify you when I post videos. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!